or we may extend this procedure by taking differences between solids. So here we have a lower graph, which is the graph corresponding to function f, and the upper function, which is the function g. And uh, we rotate the area enclosed by those graphs are about the x-axis, and then we get the volume on the right-hand side, the picture depicted in the right-hand side. So we want to calculate V, the volume of the revolution solid that is obtained as a difference of two uh, revolution solids. One uh, that we get by rotating the graph of G in between minus two to about the x-axis, and the other one is the rotation uh, the revolution solid we get uh, by rotating f around uh, rotating the, the graph of f around the about the x-axis. So what we get by uh, uh, rotating the gray area about the x-axis, and we get the volume, which is the difference of the following two solids. Yeah, so we have a kind of circular solid. And the solid on the right hand side we get by rotating the graph of f about the x axis, and the left one is the solid we get by rotating g about the x axis. Yeah, so what we get is an upper function and a lower function, so we call it yh and yl. yl is the lower part, which is f. Yeah, so we get the volume by subtracting two revolution solids, one that is specified by the radius by, by the upper function, yh, and the other one by the lower function, yl. So we get a difference of two volumes. The one that is given vh by vh is the one that is calculated by minus 2, the integral from minus 2, 2 of pi, y8 squared, yeah, so this, this is the upper function describing the area function, so the area function ax for the higher part equals pi times y8 squared, and we subtract the lower one, so the integral of minus 2 to pi yl squared. So this equals, well, just substitute yh, yeah, like so, 5 minus x squared to the power 2 dx, and we subtract the other volume, which equals the definite integral from minus 2 to of the lower part. So this is pi times 1 plus x squared to the power 2. Well, if you perform some calculations, and uh, which is not hard in this case, so we get a difference of the blue star solid minus a green star solid and uh, we are left with two rather easy integrals so after performing some calculations you may be able to find that the volume equals uh, 32 pi